Back out one last time for the Longleaf Pines pregame show. Melanie Newman for the Mobile Bay Bears, joined by Bay Bears skipper Robbie Hammock. Robbie, thank you for joining us. Thank you. So the Bay Bears found out last night that their season would eventually come to an end today. Um, they would not be seeing the playoffs. What was the team like when you walked into the clubhouse last night? Uh, it was pretty somber. Um, you know, you, you work so hard to achieve a goal, and uh, when you come up short, it's a little tough uh, to swallow at times. You know, just everybody was pretty quiet. But, you know, either way, sometimes you're just glad to know uh, what your fate is. So that's, uh, you know, it's something uh, this season they can take into the off season and learn from. And now the Bay Bears dealt with a lot of roster transactions, some injuries along the way that really hindered it a little bit. But as you look back on your first year with the club, what's your overall thought? Uh, it was pretty wild. I learned a lot uh, as a manager. Um, I know the players learned a lot. A lot of younger guys in this league uh, that you saw a lot of adjustments being made over the course of the season. Um, you saw guys get better. We sent guys on to the big leagues. Some guys, uh, you know, moved up to triple a so there was a lot of a lot of good things that happened and now looking ahead after today you're still set to come back to mobile next season what is it that you're going to start looking at to get ready for the 2016 return um i mean it's not definite i just you know i just speculate that i'll be back here the way our organization lines up with uh coaching staff um you know i know what to expect uh you know where whether it's from travel um cities ballparks hotels things like that and you, and you learn how the league is it's a very uh pitcher friendly league and so the games uh, have to be managed a certain way i learned a lot about that this year but you know ultimately it's about player development getting guys better and uh that's that's the goal next year as well so as you move into the off season do you have any particular plans uh, nothing right now. I, I will be going to instructional league, um, you know, and, and I, I love instructional league. It's a chance to see all the new younger guys in the organization from, uh, you know, from the this year's draft and some of them from last year's draft. Uh, that's always a good time. It's a month long and uh, get to know, you know, some of the younger kids that you could possibly have the following season. So that's that's pretty fun. And then, you know, basically you have off for a few months and get ready for spring training. So the Bay Bears will take the field today one last time for the 2015 season. What's your message to this club? <laughs> Let's get through today. I know it means nothing, but still, there's uh, you know there's you're always playing for yourself at uh, you know in times like this. Uh, you know you gotta <laughs> you can't just slack off the last day. I'm sure guys understand that, but um, you know it's it's tough coming out here when nothing's on the line. Uh, you know all the all the postseason uh, teams are set, but at the same time you got to figure out a way to get something out each day. Absolutely. Well, hopefully the Babers are able to get a win out of today again. Thank you. Thank you. Again with Babers manager Robbie Hammock. This is Melanie Newman. When we come back, Justin Baker will have first pitch for you between the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Mobile Babers in the final game of the 2015 season.